Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television GPTV. I'm Brad, and my hands is Silver City at number five. Very interesting issue of the series, written by Olivia Quirt. Cortero Briggs, Luca Murley's the artist, colorist, Dave Sharp is the letter. So I said in when I reviewed the previous uh, issue um, that the it really could, you know how it all came together I think would be key. This is the final issue for this series, and it definitely leaves uh, on a cliffhanger as things kind of all come together. Um, I think with some like some recent aftershock uh, series, people are either really like or dislike this ending. Um, I'm kind of in between on this. I, I really, I, I think I'm going to stick with what I said with my review of the fourth issue is that as a whole, I think this series is going to read better as a trade than individual issues. Um, this one really brings everything together, explaining what the hell is going on. Um, you'll be able to get to that quicker and not have, you know, a month's lap, uh, you know, a month in between, uh, which I think kind of hurt the series. Uh, and you'll be able to kind of dive into the, the finale, which really connects the dots in a ways that I totally did not expect. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I, this is going to be, as I said, it's going to be one that people are going to really like or really dislike. I'm generally leaning on the like uh, category of it because I just, I, it, the, there's a lot to it that I think was unexpected. Some of it's pretty easy to figure out that they've, it's been choreographed since like the first issue. Uh, but, you know, or maybe even the second issue, whatever, somewhere around there. But there's a lot to this that did not, you know, that I wasn't expecting. There's some good action, but I think, re and, and it really ties up a lot. But overall, I think how it connects a lot of the dots and the stories that and the characters that are going on gets really, really intriguing. There's a nice, I think, I want to say Tarantino spin to it, uh, bringing together all these plot lines and characters so it kind of makes sense in a way. Um, is it... Believable, yeah. There's very much a like everything having to fall perfectly aspect to it, but it's entertainment. Things just you gotta roll with it sometimes when it goes like that. Um, the art, the art of this, I think, continues to be pretty decent. You know, this isn't necessarily a a series whose art's totally blown me away, but I like the style to it, and it's really kind of built a nice atmosphere overall. Um, to me, that the series continues to like this very dark city esque aspect to it. Uh, and I think a lot of that's what's really had me intrigued. Um, and I probably just showed off pages that, you know, spoil some stuff there. So sorry about that. But the the overall, I think, is it, the, the story, I think, of five pages or five issues, stronger than the individual issues. The whole is stronger than the individual in this case. So um, this one, you know, if you can pick up all five issues and read it all at once, go for it. If you want to wait to the trade, it's not necessarily a horrible thing uh, when it comes to this. But it's, it's, uh, it's an interesting one. Um, you know, definitely surprised me a little bit at the end. Some of it's predictable, but uh, overall, I'm like generally happy with where it ended. Uh, so this is out of comic shops now. You can go get it. We got a link with uh, uh, you put in your zip code, tell the comic shops near you. No shop, no problem. We do have some affiliate links. They are affiliate links, so we get a small percentage by doing that. You help support our site. I want to thank Aftershock for hooking us up with the review copy. We appreciate that, and of course, thank you all for watching. If you are into Aftershock, if you're into comics in general, check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, Instagram, all at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. Until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.